Our today's topic is anatomy of lens. The lens is a transparent, biconvex, crystalline structure placed between iris and the vitreous in a saucer-shaped depression the patellar fossa. Its diameter is 9 to 10 mm and thickness varies with age from 3.5 mm at birth to 5 mm at extreme of age. Its weight varies from 135 mg 0 to 9 years to 255 mg 40 to 80 years of age. It has got two surfaces, the anterior surface is less convex, radius of curvature 10 mm than the posterior, radius of curvature 6 mm. These two surfaces meet at the equator. Its refractive index is 1.39 and total power is 15 to 16 d. The accommodative power of lens varies with age, being 14 to 16 d at birth, 7 to 8 d at 25 years of age, and 1 to 2 d at 50 years of age. 1. Lens Capsule It is a thin, transparent, hyaline membrane surrounding the lens which is thicker over the anterior than the posterior surface. The lens capsule is thickest at pre-equator regions 14 mu, and thinnest at the posterior pole 3 mu. 2. Anterior Epithelium It is a single layer of cuboidal cells which lies deep to the anterior capsule. In the equatorial region these cells become columnar, are actively dividing and elongating to form new lens fibers throughout the life. There is no posterior epithelium, as these cells are used up in filling the central cavity of lens vesicle during development of the lens. 3. Lens Fibers The epithelial cells elongate to form lens fibers which have a complicated structural form. Mature lens fibers are cells which have lost their nuclei. As the lens fibers are formed throughout the life, these are arranged compactly as nucleus and cortex of the lens. Nucleus, it is the central part containing the oldest fibers. It consists of different zones, which are laid down successively as the development proceeds. In the beam of slit lamp these are seen as zones of discontinuity. Depending upon the period of development, the different zones of the lens nucleus include, embryonic nucleus, it is the innermost part of nucleus which corresponds to the lens up to the first three months of gestation. It consists of the primary lens fibers which are formed by elongation of the cells of posterior wall of lens vesicle. Fetal nucleus, it lies around the embryonic nucleus and corresponds to the lens from three months of gestation till birth. Its fibers meet around sutures which are anteriorly Y-shaped and posteriorly inverted Y-shaped. Infantile nucleus corresponds to the lens from birth to puberty. Adult nucleus corresponds to the lens fibers formed after puberty to rest of the life. Cortex, it is the peripheral part which comprises the youngest lens fibers. 4. Suspensory ligaments of lens, zonules of zin. Also called as ciliary zonules, these consist essentially of a series of fibers passing from ciliary body to the lens. These hold the lens in position and enable the ciliary muscle to act on it. These fibers are arranged in three groups, the fibers arising from pars plana and anterior part of ora serrata pass anteriorly to get inserted anterior to the equator. The fibers originating from comparatively anteriorly placed ciliary processes pass posteriorly to be inserted posterior to the equator. The third group of fibers passes from the summits of the ciliary processes almost directly inward to be inserted at the equator.